hello! How are my little artichokes? Are you guys good this morning? Today, I'm in a different setup. Can you guess what we're gonna try out today? No, we aren't gonna take a nap. Not really. That would be nice, huh? What else do you think we might be doing today? No, we're not playing football. No, not like this. Do you see how I'm dressed? I'm getting ready to do exercise. Do you have exercise clothes? Something that's comfortable? Something that you can move around in? That's what we're gonna do today. So if you've got your exercise clothes on, let's get ready to go. Because today, we're gonna do one of my favorite exercises. It's called yoga. Yoga is a practice where we do lots of stretching. And we do lots of bending and folding and lots and lots of nice work and exercising our muscles and our body. So if you're ready to join me, you can find a nice comfy spot on the floor because today's story is called the yoga game. The yoga game, hmm, did you know that exercising can be a fun game? Today we're gonna figure out which animals we are gonna try to pose in. Yoga has a lot of poses. So we're gonna see which animal you think we're gonna pose as. Are you ready? The Yoga Game is written by Kathy Bellevue, illustrated by Farida Salmon. Are you on the floor, ready to go? Here we go. I flit and flutter everywhere. Happy, free, as light as air. With silent grace, I land on things, and sunlight dances on my wings. What am I? What pose do you think we're gonna do? I am a butterfly. Should we try our butterfly pose? We put our feet together, and we open up our knees and push them to the floor. And if you want, we can flutter our wings. Look at that. Not too fast. We don't want to fly away. Should we see what our next pose is? Softer than a breath. That's me. I'm known to be bumbly. A ball of black and yellow fuzz. My song is like a low deep buzz. What am I? I'm a bumblebee! Should we do our bumblebee pose? Now, we're gonna cross our legs, we're gonna cover our ears with our hands, and we're gonna make a buzz sound. Are you ready? Could you hear it? Did it sound like you were buzzing in a hive? Very cool. Should we see what our next pose is gonna be? One foot stands planted on the ground, and in my mind I send roots down. Balancing my arms stretch high like branches reaching to the sky. What am I? I am a tree. Let's try our tree pose, standing nice and tall. Let's bring our hands up into the air and grow our branches, if you'd like. You can grab your foot, bring it to your knee. You guys are nice tall trees. Great job, let's see what we have next. I love a place that's warm and nice to rest my paws and dream of mice. Where in between my nap and snack, there's time to arch and stretch my back. What am I? Hmm. I am a cat. Should we try our cat pose? Let's we'll see if Chino likes our cat pose here. We're gonna go down, plant your hands underneath you, your knees, and then we're gonna arch and pull like someone's pulling string up to the ceiling. Like a cat stretching. Ooh! Very nice. Let's see what our next pose is gonna be. I can reach way up high and paint my magic in the sky. Radiant colors everywhere. See them balance in the air. What am I? Hmm. 
I am a rainbow. Should we make a rainbow? What you do is you put one hand down, lean to the side, leave one leg on the ground, stretch out the other leg and reach up high and make a nice arch with your body. And if you want to make a rainbow wave, you can wave your arm just like that. Nice rainbows. Should we see what next we're going to pose as? No arms or legs to help me climb. I slither and slide along my spine. Some say I have a dangerous kiss. Beware of me when I stretch, I hiss. What am I? I am a cobra! Did you know that we could pose as cobras? Should we try? We're gonna get on our bellies. And we're gonna get down on our arms. And then we're gonna reach up, press up your arms, arch like a cobra and go. Nice cobras. Should we see what we're gonna pose as next? I am gray, I am small. My back is rounded like a ball. I nibble cheese and things like that. Then scamper past and tease the cat. What am I? <gasps> I am a mouse. We're gonna curl up like a mouse, shall we? We're gonna go down onto our knees. And then we're gonna lower down and we're gonna wrap our arms hugging the ground and rest as small and tiny as a mouse. <sighs> Ooh, that was nice. I am much bigger than a hill. I stand strong, I stand still. The wind and snow cover my face. I stand majestic in my place. What am I? I am a mountain. Let's try our mountain pose. You're gonna stand up nice and tall. You're gonna plant your feet down on the ground, hands by your side, and you're gonna stand nice and strong. And I bet if I tried to blow over your mountain, you wouldn't fall over. Should we try? One, two, three. Wow, what strong, firm mountains you are. Good job. Let's see what we have next. I soar above the land and sea, or sit upon a giant tree. Perching poised with piercing eyes, I silently search sea and skies. What am I? I am an eagle. Should we try our eagle pose? You're gonna stand up nice and tall. You're gonna cross one leg over the other. You're gonna bring your arms and you're gonna cross them and twist them and sit down just a little. And now you look like an eagle. And untwist. Nicely done. Let's see our next pose. They call me king, though I have no crown, but I can make a mighty sound. I crouch down low on the jungle floor, and then I leap and pounce and roar. What am I? I am a lion. Are you guys ready to make a lion noise? We get on our knees. We stand up nice and tall. And let's make a nice roaring sound on the count of three. One, two, three. Nice roars, guys. Ooh, I'm a little scared. I burst up through the warm blue sea, then dive down low and splash with glee. I click and cluck and whistle around, my laughter bubbles all around. What am I? Hmm. I am a dolphin. Are you ready for a dolphin pose? We're gonna get on our hands and knees and reach out long. Come down to your elbows and then put your bottoms in the air. And if you want, you can make a dolphin noise. <laughs> Nicely done, you guys. Great dolphins. 
I stretch my arms and legs out wide. I hold my head with grace and pride. I glow and twinkle and shine so bright. It feels good to share my light. What am I? I am a star. Should we make stars? Should we try our star pose? Now standing up, nice and tall. Spread your legs out, nice and wide. Open up your arms. We're a five-pointed star. One, two, three, four, five. Nice, are you shining brightly? Great job, let's see what we have next. The squishy mud of lakes and ponds inspires me to sing my songs. I croak, I swim, I hop about. I squat and stick my tongue way out. What am I? I am a frog. Ooh, should we try this frog pose? So it means we're gonna squat down low, bend our knees, hands down low. <gasps> Are you ready to rivet? Let's do a little hop, shall we? One, two, three. Rivet! Another one. One, two, three. Rivet! <gasps> nice frog pose, guys. That was great. I have a hump upon my back. It is my secret water sack. I come from an exotic land of scorching sun and desert sand. What am I? I'm a camel! Ooh, this one looks like a nice tough one. Should we try it? So we're gonna go on our knees and we're gonna stand up tall. Then if you can, we're gonna reach back. And if you wanna stay here, that's fine. But if you think you can grab your heels and ankles and you reach back, ooh, look up to the sky. Ooh, that was a great camel. Nice, guys. Slow and steady wins the race. I do not like a hectic pace. A simple shell is all I own to go within to be at home. What am I? I am a tortoise. Ooh, should we try and get into our tortoise shells? We're going to bring our feet together, just like this. We're going to take our arms. We're going to put them in through our legs and grab our feet and slower down and pretend we're in our tortoise shells. <gasps> Nicely done. One more. I breathe the air, the air breathes me. I am the land, I am the sea. I am a cloud that drifts above. I am special, I am love. What am I? I am me. How we end our yoga practice is with one simple word, Namaste. We put our hands together like this and we just thank ourselves for taking time to stretch our bodies, wiggle, and pose like animals. It's pretty fun. Should we try it? We're going to say Namaste on three. One, two, three. Namaste. Thank you so much for joining me and doing some fun yoga poses. Like I said, it's my favorite thing because I get to pretend to be fun animals. You can do it too anytime you'd like. Come up with a fun animal pose, but don't hurt yourself too hard. We don't want to pull and stretch ourselves. So be careful, but also have fun. Bye guys.